Hey there, so it is Sunday, the last day of Geekway, and I am fucking tired. The, uh, uh, finally got to play Terraform in Mars again, so that was fun. Um, I'm just tired. I slept about four hours last night, if that long. I haven't had breakfast yet. I'm going to stop off and get that before I go to the convention center. But <clears throat> I have a bit of a cough this morning and a bit of a raspy throat. So, you know, that's a thing. Um, did some more magic last night. That was fun. I got some really cool cards that I don't have yet. So that's, that's cool. Um, I did get my capture card for the uh, for capturing play uh, let's play videos, so that's really fun. I've got that sitting at home waiting for me. Uh, Breath of the Wild is ready to go. Go well, I should say it will be. I gotta first put the disc in so we can install. Yep. Uh, but then Breath of the Wild should be good to go. Um, I'm gonna do a test run with a different game first. Just to make sure levels work, everything works good, so that way I'm not recording really shit. I want to get a good quality out there for the recordings for Let's Plays. Um, don't know when they'll get posted. Um, kind of like these videos, I'll be posting them as fast as I can. Uh, these I've been trying not to edit anything, so that way you, uh, so that way I can upload it as quickly as possible. Um, I still got one the video I think from like Saturday to upload. Or one or two videos to upload still, so like I said, by the time this goes up, it should be up already. Um, other than that, I got nothing else. Like, it's early in my vacation, so uh, people are driving like idiots. Uh, last night on the drive home, at about well, I say last night, this morning, about 4:30. Jesus, people flying around here. Um, I'm doing like 10 over the speed limit, so it's not like I'm exactly obeying the law, but eh, not quite 10, but whatever. Um, and I'm getting blown off the road here by these people. Um, but last night driving, or this morning driving home, um, there was a car fire that blocked off almost the entire highway, so it must have been pretty intense. It was out by the time I drove past it, but... Uh, that was kind of my exciting stuff there. Uh, I did open in prize packs. Uh, my draft, I opened decent cards, not really any money. Um, nothing too terribly exciting. Um, but then in prize packs, there were two packs of French cons of Tarkir. And I opened up a Flooded Strand, which is awesome. And I opened up a Sarkon Dragon Speaker. So that's cool. I have a French Sarkon. French flooded strand. I'll probably trade away the French uh, Sarkon. Um, you know, this has been fun. This weekend's been fun. I've got to play with friends, been around a lot of uh, games. I've only played two games twice. Everything else I played once. So the two games I played twice, well, I didn't really play the second one for Gloomhaven. I was there at the table as they finish it up. And the only other one I played twice was Terraforming Mars. Which that was kind of the thing that kind of pissed me off the most. Um, people were hoarding games for the play and win. So, like Terraforming Mars, there were only two copies in the play to win library. And someone yesterday afternoon when they did announcements, someone they said that someone had one of them checked out for over 16 hours and yes it can be a little bit of a long game so it says 90 to 120 minutes which isn't far from the truth the last game we got to play lasted about two hours and yeah there's a learning curve with it and it takes a little bit of time especially the first time you're playing it but 16 hours is ridiculous and that's hoarding it and they were basically trying to 
record it long enough to where there's so few entries in it except for theirs that they win that plane win game so i mean that's kind of shitty and not something i would do um i do try and play at one time and get it back like we could have played the harry potter we played the harry potter card game yesterday and it was a lot of fun but uh, the way it's set up is each year of Harry Potter at Hogwarts, um, you get a specific set of cards that get added to the deck. Wow, people are, hmm, people are being asses here. Yeah, I don't care. It's not my fault you're in the wrong lane. Um, but, uh, yeah, so, um, and I didn't hoard it. I uh, I wasn't gonna hoard it. I wanted to. Do, I wanted to play it, see what it was like. It's a deck building game. It's a lot of fun. I'm a Harry Potter fan. It's right up my alley. And we played through year one, and that was really kind of fun. It was very simple, very easy to pick up. Um, but apparently, as you go through his career, I guess career, his career at Hogwarts, it was. Uh, you add more cards to the deck until finally you get to year seven. I didn't really spend any time at Hogwarts, but the final hog, uh, battle at Hogwarts happens, and you have all seven boxes of cards basically. So, but I didn't want to do that. I didn't want to play through each year to kind of screw over other people who wanted to play the game. Jesus fucking Christ. So, anyways. Well, I'm going to stop here, because um, obviously people are in a hurry this morning. I don't know why. But anyways, I'm going to get some breakfast, head over, check out the flea market, because I'll have like a bunch of used games and stuff on sale there. Maybe I can get a deal. Who knows? And then finish up Geekway. Maybe win a game and play to win. Maybe not. I don't know. Maybe win a door prize. Maybe not. And then call it a weekend, get some rest, and then come back tomorrow to try and record some more stuff. So until next time, I'm probably not going to have any other videos from Geekway. I hope anyone who went to Geekway had a lot of fun. I hope if you didn't go to Geekway but you like board games, that you show up next year. Um, it's going to be even bigger and better and a lot of fun. And we can meet up there because I intend to do it. But until then, until the next video, don't forget to be awesome.